Hello, I am Dr. Del Pizzo. I'm one of the anesthesiologists at Hospital for Special Surgery. And in this video, we will be reviewing how to remove a nerve block catheter. When the medicine in the reservoir is gone, it is time to remove the catheter. It may be helpful for an adult responsible for your care to remove it for you. Your care team may request that you remove the catheter during a scheduled telehealth appointment. Follow these steps to remove a catheter. Step one, wash your hands with soap and water for at least 20 seconds. Step two, carefully remove the dressing that is holding the catheter in place. Step three, firmly grasp the catheter close to the entry site. Step four, Gently pull on the catheter to remove it from your skin. The catheter should come out smoothly and you should feel minimal to no discomfort. If there is any difficulty removing the catheter, such as catching, kinking, or stretching, or if you feel any pain or tingling in the limb during removal, stop immediately, retape the catheter, and call the nerve block catheter helpline provided to you at discharge. Step five, once the catheter is removed, you may notice some clear drainage or a small amount of blood at the site. This is completely normal and is nothing to worry about. Clean the site with alcohol wipes provided in your care package at discharge. Repeat if needed. Step six, Cover the site with a Band-Aid or clean gauze and tape. Step seven, make sure the catheter tip was fully removed. Depending on the type of catheter, it may have a black, blue, or silver tip. If you are unsure, you can take a picture of the catheter tip and call the nerve block catheter helpline. They can tell you who to send the picture to in order to make sure it was fully removed. If the tip is in one piece, Place the catheter, pump, and tubing in a plastic bag, seal it, and throw it in the trash. Wash your hands when you're finished. If there is no colored marking at the tip, place the catheter, tubing, and pump into a plastic bag and do not throw it away. Wash your hands, then contact the nerve block catheter helpline. The doctor may wish to see the catheter and infusion pump. After the catheter is removed, you may continue to use other pain relief methods, including oral pain medications. If you have any questions about removing the catheter, please do not hesitate to talk with your care team or to call the nerve block catheter helpline.